Hello everybody and welcome to our demonstration today of a spring valentine bouquet. So this bouquet focuses slightly more on the meaning of flowers, so steering away from that traditional red. So every flower that I'm using here has actually got a significant meaning. So I'm going to be using today Eucalyptus cinerea, then I have a mini gerbera. This variety is actually called surfer and mini gerberas signify cheerfulness. So nice, bright, happy flower. Then I have some ranunculus. Ranunculus signify radiant charm. Then I have some tulips. Now tulips, well, they signify hopeless love. Or in yellow in particular, is there's sunshine in your smile. And then I have some white roses. So roses are purity and innocence, if they're white. And then finally, I have some white carnations. White carnations again signify innocence, but also pure love. So, I hope you enjoy. So I hope you enjoyed our demonstration of a spring valentine bouquet. As always, I have some top tips for you. So my top tip number one is always wear your germinis. It helps to actually make the head stand up and you have a little bit of ability to actually then manoeuvre them into the position you want them. Top tip number two, 
Don't forget the tulips are phototropic, so they will actually bend to the light and they will also grow overnight. So bear that in mind when you're putting the design together. And then top tip number three, you could actually make this up a couple of days in advance, store it in water and then actually do the final dressing the day before you want to send it out. All right, so thank you so much for watching. I hope this has inspired you to add, add a little bit more thought to your Valentine's designs this year. Think slightly out of the box rather than going for that traditional red. Like us, share us, and don't forget to visit our YouTube channel for lots more tips, hints, and inspirational ideas. Thanks so much for watching us. We look forward to welcoming you back again very soon. Bye for now.